All right, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys this crazy new feature in FL Studio 24 that literally makes making beats so easy now. I mean, you pretty much have to know nothing about music anymore and you can make a beat on the spot. So basically what we're gonna do in this video, I'm gonna show you this feature and I'm gonna speed run a beat and I guarantee you I could get something done that sounds pretty damn good in five minutes. We're gonna shoot for something kind of like an indie style, just cause I've been feeling like some kind of like guitars recently for some reason. I might even throw the Juice World preset on here later and see if we can make a little song. But yeah, I don't really have anything planned, so I'm just gonna freestyle it as we go and just see what happens. And I'm assuming we're gonna make something pretty good. Before we do jump into FL Studio, make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe if you're new here. And if you're not following me on Instagram, make sure you do that. Cause I put stuff on my stories asking you guys like what type of videos you wanna see next from me. So it's a great way to just stay up to date with what I'm doing. but. Let's jump in FL. All right, so right off the bat to start this, what we're gonna do is bring the BPM down to like 120. Actually, you know what? We'll just keep it at 140 for now. We could always change it later. I'm just gonna open up a random piano. I'm just gonna open up FL keys, honestly. So this is the crazy feature that will literally turn anybody into a producer. So what we're gonna do here is go into our FL keys piano roll, hit Alt P on the keyboard. That's gonna pull up this chord progression generator. Now you can right click right here to change the scale. I'm gonna go with A minor, cause that's just one of my favorite scales to work in. Pause. And as you can see, it already generated some chords. I'm gonna re-click generate, so it's an A minor. And we're gonna play this and you're gonna see right off the bat, we have a progression ready. All right, so I don't like these last two chords, but you can just click this little down arrow and change it. Let's bring this to a C. And then you click accept and you already have the chords generated right here. Now, obviously it's a very boring progression. It's just kind of hitting on every beat, but that's the cool part. We could go around and just mess with this now. So what I'm gonna instantly do is just right click, replace. We're gonna go to contact and I'm gonna grab this guitar plugin that I always use. It's probably one of the best guitar plugins that you can use. It's a bank that you gotta get in contact, but um, I'm telling you it's worth it. And I'm just gonna keep it on the default preset. Uh, I'm gonna take the bass layer out right now and we're just gonna go in and arpeggiate these notes. So something like this, let's see. This is what we'll do. So I'm gonna actually invert these middle notes and bring them up an octave, and then we're gonna arpeggiate it. So as we get this, and then let me change the scale. Are we in A minor? We change the scale highlighting over to view uh, scale highlighting. Where is this? Where is the minor? Pause. All right. So now I'm just gonna mess around with this until I get some kind of flow that I like here. And there we go. All you had to do is mess with it a little bit. I'm going to throw a Valhalla Vintage Verb on here just to uh, make it a little more like euphoric sounding. All right, now I'm going to copy this over to just like a felt piano and we're pretty much good. I'll make like some kind of lead on top of that as well. And then we'll just get started on the drums. So I'm going to grab this Olafur Arnold's piano. I said that right, might be butchering that. Uh, and then we're just gonna copy this progression over. All 
All right, so now I'm just going to make a lead on top of that. So I cloned the Electric Sunburst Deluxe, and we're going to grab just some random preset. I'm going to turn on the typing piano thing so I can use my keyboard. Yeah, this will be cool. All right, so that's about all I'm gonna do for the melody. I don't think we need much more. So I'm gonna take all of these. So I'm gonna highlight all these by holding control and dragging my mouse over. And then we're going to shift click this button down here. Or my bad, control click. So that's gonna send it over to this bus. We'll call this the melody bus. And this will just allow us to throw an EQ on here. Go like this. So now we can add the drums and not have any of the bass uh, mess with that. So I'm going to go into my full circle drum kit. This and throw some random MIDI in here. Grab a simple spins here, and I'm just gonna grab some random MIDI and just match it up to what do we actually have here? C B D C. There's a full beat right there, so now I'm just gonna throw a preset on here, show you guys how you could just make a full song if you really wanted to from scratch. So what I'm gonna do is right click this uh, channel and go to split by channel, so we have all of the separate layers now, and we're just gonna drag it in here. I'm just gonna duplicate it over a bunch, and what we're gonna do is just start this out with everything. All right, so I like that. I'm going to drag this down to make room for the preset. I'm going to go to an open mixer track, and I'm going to go to where I have my presets located. Um, let me find this real quick. Well, presets, and we're going to grab the Juice World preset. Uh, so I have it right here, and all I'm going to do is drag this in like that. Everything's loaded up. Right, so the only thing we really have to do is change the auto-tune to A minor, and I think we should be good. So what I'm going to do is right-click on the main box, click A, which is going to assign it to new audio tracks. It's going to bring it here. And then we're going to set the input, input one. And then you want to make sure this is set to when armed. And then as soon as we click this record button, we're going to be able to hear our voice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh.
Dip my purse in my double cup I was in my room by myself I can't even run it up I was lost and I couldn't find you Now I think that I'm up cause I'm off you Alright, uh, let's do a little ad-lib run So we're just gonna go to the ad-libs uh, click, Right click A And then do the same thing so that put through the ad-libs, so we just got to make this a lot louder. All right. Uh, all right, so that's all I got for now. I'm going to let you guys listen to this, and, of course, we're going to end it with a little freestyle, uh, and we'll just see how it goes. But if you guys want this preset, it's always linked down in the description below. But uh, let's listen. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Everything I'm doing, you be acting like a cow, man It's like that I'm living, I bought everything